now you don't want to be useful to yourself every time no be you don't vam 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 you go make him hey because you go make him sister i want to be useful to myself i really want to be useful but the problem i have is that my mind have refused to repent yes that's the problem that is why i have decided to set it on fire now come by your home very stupid thank you sister. it is with a very it is with a stupid thank you sister because you are not doing yourself any good you are not. You are a man and you need to hustle. You need to fight for your future. You must not end up like our father now. Shut up, I'm still talking. Yes. Ebuka, you need to hustle. Hustle like a man and make money. Ebuka, hustle. What is this? Bo, sister, came the name. You know how many times I've gone out there to serve a master. Eh? But there are so many wicked people out there. See, they derive joy in making people shed tears. Hmm? These are wicked people. All they do is to treat people with wickedness. Wickedness! I can't do that again. No. Ebuka, you cannot work under anybody to make money. Start up a trade. Be done from somewhere. Eh? Start up something. No matter how small it is, start up something. No problem, sister. I've had you. Eh? Sister came the name. I've had you. I will do it. See, let me promise you. I will make you proud. I will make it in a big way. Now, make it yeah, by the time I come back to this village. Eh? On your traditional marriage day, eh? I will spray you money. Me a bogey dollar. Bam! Nine by nine resuria. Any kind of foreign currency. I will spray Ebuka, you. Sister. sister. Stop smoking and look for work. Ebuka, go and walk. Yes, sister. Ogo Banaya na make it vam 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 vam. You can make him. Ebuka, will you make it? Yes, sister, you know now. Go, go, I will make it. In a big way. This way. I got a bogey one nebuka sinega. Thank you. Make a very big. She does get one. I just managed to use my small and use my sister. Now, I'm going to declare. They don't want to help people. Make your own the high. Buy mafia. One name is everywhere. I will make sure I make it very big. People will get here. Once again, thanks for the cooler. You know, the other time your daughter helped me, yes. Got a mechanic for me, my car was fixed. So but something happened. When I dashed her money in appreciation, she said no. I was like, for real? That's rare with uh, children of these days. So I asked, who is the father of this responsible girl? She said, it's you. So I'm here to say thank you for raising your daughter well. Mm. Secondly, I wish she's a man. I'm taking her to help me like apprenticeship. Mm. You came to my daughter. Mm. My daughter. Yeah. Yeah. I thank God for giving me a daughter. And I'm so, so proud of her. She's different. I'm proud of what she did. But, um, can she serve? Like, I need someone who will serve me for like five years and I'm settled. That's why I said I wish she's a man. <laughs> she is a woman. Her husband may not like business. And again, no woman knows her future except until after marriage. So, what happened to. What a man can do, a woman can do. Better. Papa, I take exception to that. Yes, I take exception to that, Papa. Good day, sir. Fine, thank you, sir. Papa, I don't tell you before now. I tell you, say I want to make it. I want make him. I'm not with this village now. I go take make him now. Why do they do like this? I told you I want to make my own money before getting married. I told you this before. Sir, no vex. I beg. If you have any business that you want to introduce me to, I am ready to do it. Please. Any business at all, I'll do it. Can yes, you sir. do boy boy for like five years? Uh -uh. I can't do you. anything, sir. I can't do anything. Any kind of work, I can do it. I can serve, sir. No, 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 no. Women don't serve. Papa, I said I want to serve now. No, 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 no. Women don't serve. Uh -uh. Papa, I can serve. Is it 
I forced to stay in this village with you? We men don't have all the time required to serve. All you should be praying now is that God should give you a husband, you get married and settle down. Papa, that narrative has long changed. It has changed though. A girl's life is no longer about husband, family and children. It's not. We have our own life to live. Maybe those days where everybody wants to get married. Me, I do not want to get married, sir. I don't want. I know you don't have money to fund my education. No problem. I accept. But you cannot stop me from going to serve and make my own money. You cannot stop me, Papa. What is this? I'm sorry, sir, if my voice is too high, but that's the truth. I'm sorry. Uh, no. If I'm uh, get her to wash it. She not get wala. She dey on her lane. What's up, darling? You're welcome. I missed you. Oh, oh. Mm. Mm. Miss you. Oh, you look good. How have you been? The girl you told me about over the phone. Yes. Mm. I've never seen a girl say. Besides, how can you bring this big girl into a matrimonial home? Oh, I thought she was still a child. I, I, I beg you in the name of God, don't send me away. Even from home, all odds have kicked against this. But I beg you, give me the opportunity to prove to you I am not like what people think of me. I beg you. So, you do not trust me? It's not what I'm saying. Oh, baby, I brought her because we need someone to assist us in our business. <laughs> Listen, she needs the job. But if you are not comfortable with her, give her transport money to go back home. Mm. Please. You're taking this thing personal. Well, you are the one of the house. If you don't like her, she can go. If you don't You're taking this thing personal, Yeah? <laughs> Thank you. Only one try I will convince you. I beg you. I, I won't disappoint you. I promise you, ma. With that life we used to talk. You see this my husband? Yes, Jiria Sorom. That's all. Just be a good girl. I will be a good girl, ma. I'm a very good girl. Where is she, Kendilim? Sir, she went out. To where? Sir, I don't know, sir. She's always going out. I knew you don't know. Sir, she didn't tell me where she was going to. Check how much we have cash. I'll get back to you. All right, sir. Oga, you need to trust me. I will give you these goods at the cheapest rates you can ever get in the market. Wow. I'm not playing with you, sir. Wow, you sound so confident. Ah. This is really funny. <sighs> sir, the problem here is that you don't believe I know this business so much. I, I mean, I haven't seen any girl sound this mean. Just take a look at this building. Take a look, take a look. Can you see? I'm afraid you might not give me what I want. Ah, ah, sir, this is the smallest building I've ever supplied goods to. Oh. This one now. It's too small now. Ah, ah. Don't worry, let's do it this way. Okay. I'll supply the goods to you. Okay. And if you don't like them, I'll take it back. Fair enough. You don't okay. need to fight at all at all. Fair enough, fair enough, fair enough. Okay, you know what? I'll give you my list. Okay, sir. I just want to give you a try. Sir, trust me. I will not disappoint you. Really? Ha, me. Don't worry, sir. Just relax. Fair enough. I'll give you my list. I just want to give you a try. Ha. Don't worry, sir. I will not disappoint you. Okay. I promise. You, okay. We're starting from the first floor. And if my boss likes it, okay. we can continue. Okay, sir. No problem. <laughs> it's okay, sir. <laughs> no problem, sir. I do. Very okay, sir. All right. Don't worry. You don't need to be scared of anything. No problem. It's not me again. Relax. Relax. Easier okay. said than done. Okay, sir. You said you'll give me the... Okay, I'll give you the list. Uh, yes, sir. I think we should start from there. Okay, sir. Your spirit is high. You a high star girl. Straight to business. You a look at you. You a one Come now. I got there inside. And you just ask me a few. No, 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 no. See my team. I got no day happy with you at all. 
and you don't tell her, God say I go look for customers. Eh? Your common sense, whether you say I go find customers. I won't take no. You didn't tell me where you are going to when you are leaving. Timothy, you are very stupid. You must be very foolish. How can you be this wicked? How am I wicked? See, please don't insult me. You better go inside and see what you brought upon to yourself. Shabia, don't tell you say no go make her. With this your wuru attitude, there's no way you will make it. You cannot make it in this life. I don't need to argue with Timothy, you. Timothy, you will not make it. I go make her. I go make. See, take your time, oh. Mind where they take you. Sort me for this shop. We will not be made to. Oh. What kind? Which kind of sense be this one now? What if you you been sorting me in this shop? Next time, oh. Next time. She like a man. People will get to get the to look for customers. I mean, I was not comfortable staying here, knowing that I have not sold anything since morning. So you've been gallivanting inside the market? No, sir. I went to look for customers. So what was the outcome? Since you went to look for customers? Okay, sir. Here are the list of goods to supply. It's about 1.5 million naira worth of goods. Are you serious? Yes. This is quite impressive. But there, there are some goods that we don't have here. Yes, I know that, but I cannot tell a customer that, sir. I'll go and buy the goods and then we sell to the customers. All we need is profit, sir. Who taught you that? <laughs> no one, sir. I, I just... I always think of making more profits and making more sales. That's how all the ideas come through my Keep it up. Nice work. Very, very stupid. Welcome, Gigi. You are sleeping by 15 minutes after 2. I'm going to see my customer better on Adjaz Rock. You are sleeping when your mates are out there hustling. Now, what's up? You're looking for customers. You are here sleeping by 15 minutes after 2. Actually, sir, there was no customer. So I decided to take a little nap, sir. How will you see customer when you are sleeping? Thomas, how will you see customer when you are sleeping? So I brought you all the way from your village to come and be sleeping here. Eh? By the end of the year, I will pay for this shop. When you come out in the morning, you eat of alcohol and you are sleeping. You will never be useful in life again. If I curse you out of anger, you will be useless forever. You are sleeping by this time of the day. That shows you hate me. Okay, I have gotten another customer. Please, I will be needing some money to buy most of the things we don't have shop. Look at what your mates are doing. Looking for customers, getting supply, a woman for that matter, and you are here sleeping. You are here sleeping by 15 minutes after 2. Later you will eat. Sir, please attend to me. I have time limit to supply everything on this list. No problem. In fact, need that. Sir, she need that. I said you. Sorry, sir. Don't, sir. Case get the fridge. Sir, this last. My love, Nkemdilim is a hard worker. 
Mm. I never believed a woman could be that active in a business. Mm. She worked so hard. Baby, you don't need to tell me. Huh. That girl does everything in this house without me telling her, do this, do that. She's just, that girl is just a bundle of joy. Heaven sent. She's a blessing now. Tell she me. works so hard. She's so humble, mm. dedicated, and passionate about what she does. I'm telling you, I know. If you see how hard she works at the shop every day, eh? you won't let her do domestic shows. I'm telling you. Bibi, as I speak with you right now, she's in the kitchen cooking. <laughs> telling you, Bibi. Are you serious? Yes. Come on, baby, that's not fair now. This girl works from morning till night at the office. You don't. No, 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 no. Please stop her from doing all that. Babe, it's not my fault. She won't let me do anything. No. Ah, she'll be like, Madam, just sit here. I'll do it. That girl is really a blessing, baby. True, true. Never judge a book by its cover. Mm -hmm. What else, by the way? How was your day? It was okay, baby. I missed you. How was work today? Work was fine. I missed you. Baby. I missed you too. Baby. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes, so, how is my son? It's fine, no. I had to force him to go and sleep. Ah. Why yes. force him to sleep? That's wrong now. Stop using hard hands on that ball. Maybe I'm not using hard hands. He has been playing, playing, playing. He should go and sleep. Yeah. I want to know where they go. Baby. Ah, don't spoil him. Yeah. Good afternoon, sir. Ah, hey, Abuchi. Sir. How are you? I'm fine, sir. Mm. But I just got back from the city. I decided to come and check on my friend. Uh, you went to serve at uh, Nkwonnewi. I got a bad boy. What? Uh, I, I'm surprised to hear that. I'm currently based on it and it's not far from Nkwonnewi. Okay, Papa, can I at least get her number so that I can call her when I get back to the city? Okay. Alright, that's her number. Lucky, let's go. Sorry, you promised to pay our school fees today. Remember, they sent me away last time. Don't worry, I've already told your teacher they won't send you away today, okay? Let's go. But why will you pay my school fees? I've called your teacher already. Don't worry, okay? Don't worry, let's go. You're running late. Go, everything right? Timothy, if only we can supply the goods on this list. We're making so much profit. <laughs> Honestly. You are such a comedian. Is this a food list of what? See, look around. We don't have goods to sell. And we don't have money to buy and supply. And you are bringing another list. Why? Honestly, this is so tiring. I wish Oga can make a way out of this. It's frustrating. I don't know what else to do. Stop wishing. Remember, this is not your business. Slow down. You can't be more serious than the person that owns the shop. It's very foolish. Timothy, do you do you need the stupid? Shame you don't see why you, you don't see why I say you know maker. You don't see him now. I'm gonna talk, gonna talk up, I'm gonna talk of points. Listen, I've been here before you. Mind the way you talk to me. In my list. Mind the way I talk to you. Shift go. Your spirit is high. You were high star. No need to answer you again. Welcome, sir. We no longer have goods to sell. 
and there is no money to place over. Obego. Obego. My goods have been seized. This is the third time. This is this is happening. I don't even know what to do. We are bankrupt. We are in debt. What are we going to do right now? Thank God to save us. That's our last one. I'm finished. This is this is this is from zero to zero now. From Bonnie Tiles International to Obego and Sons Nigerian Limited. Obego. So you mean your master have settled you? Yes. Although the money he settled me with is not that big, but I am glad that I'm a free person now. At least I can hustle on my own. <laughs> That's very important. Mm -hmm. Because I'm a woman, my apprenticeship years was recourse for. And it ended last month. So why is he still keeping you? <sighs> my boss is going through a lot right now. That's the reason for the delay. Are you sure? Because <laughs> most bosses behave like this towards their servant. Especially when it comes to the to the end time of them settling them. My boss is not like that. He is a nice person. He will not deceive me. And he won't disappoint me. <sighs> but I know he's going through so much right now. But I'm sure once he solves his problems, he will say to me. I hope so, because we have a new life to start, you know, together. Uh, would you keep that new life on the freezer first? Why? We'll talk about it later. For now, <laughs> I've really missed you, right? I've missed you so much. I've missed you too. You know what? And I'm happy to see you. Me too, but <laughs> right now I feel like, you know, taking you home. Don't say that again. Why? Take me home for why would you want to do that? Because you're my girlfriend. No. Don't say that again. Why why I can <laughs> scream if you want me to? Do you want to do beer or want me to get one of, you know? But you know I would do that. No, I won't. I'm just kidding. <laughs> How are you? Fine, thank you. Lucky. You're not looking happy. Daddy came back and he wasn't looking happy. Don't worry. Daddy will be fine. Okay? Okay. Have you eaten? No, I haven't eaten since I came back from school. There's no food in the house. Not to worry. I'll go get you something to eat. All right? Okay. I'll be back.
Lucky. You have to take it easy. So you don't get choked. Alright? that Lucky told me he hasn't eaten, so I was able to run around and raise more money. That's what I use in making food. Okay. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you so much. Okay, let Lucky eat. I'll, I'll join you later. He, he's eating already. Oh. Yes. Okay, I don't know what to say, but only God will bless you. Amen. Thank you. You can come and eat. I'll join you later. Thank you so much, Ken. You're welcome, man. This girl is just God sent to me. Hi, precious gift to my family at these hard times. Thank you. Hi. A father are you? Tell me. Your daughter has overstayed her duration on her apprenticeship and you've not tried to do anything about it. What kind of a father are you? Tell me. What are you still doing? I've called him somebody. But he keep telling me that he's working on it and I should give him more time. And you allow that? Eh? You allow that? Remember Nkem Delemi is a woman. He should let her go so that she can move on with her life. Especially now that she's at her prime. Uh -uh. Do something, oh. You want me to go and fight him? You have to make him do it! Eh? Listen, let me tell you. If you don't want to do anything about it, and she continues staying there, I will be forced to do something. Yes! There you will know that what a man can do, a woman will do it even more better, and you may not like it. A guy like it, queer. You will not like it, oh. You got her like it, queer. I've said my point. About your settlement, right? Yes, sir. And due to be settled. I know you are due for settlement. But I'm working on something. Give me a little more time. Sir. I will settle you. For how long will I have to wait? Just a little more time. Be patient. Once my good arrives, I will settle you. I've even discussed it with your family members. So please, calm down, okay? Give me a little time. I will definitely settle you. Oh? 
Ok, ça. Ichi Ewani. Boniface. This is not what we discussed. Why are you going against our agreement? I know this is not what we agreed on. But I'm going through a lot now. Please. Give me a little time. I will settle her. I promise, before this year runs out, I will settle her. Iko. What can you find her? This is not what we discussed. Send her back to me. When you're ready to settle her, you come and settle her here. No, Ichi Ewani, please. Don't take her away from us. We need her. All I'm asking for is a little time, please. I will come and settle her before this year runs out. Just that I've been fluctuating lately business wise. What can you feel me? But oh God, so give me a little time, oh. Biko. You know it was not my intention in the first place for you to take her away. You must do the needful before this result to problem. You are financially okay. God has blessed you enough. All you need just now is to be prayerful. Don't be longer. Run away from them. Run away from them. Don't accept oh. Run away from them. Well, I'll Run away, Run away from them. Run away from them. We lose our fortune. Yes, she is making a lot of money for him. Yes, that is why he doesn't want to let her go. No, how can someone come into my family here and take a girl that has been helping me over the years? Now I will do something crazy. I will do something crazy, yo. See, I only allowed her because the Ibar boy system of trading has been helpful to our people. To who? Helpful to who? To our boys, not our girls. Tell me one girl is has helped. Tell me. Tell me one. So so to Ofu. See, you must know that if he settles her, we all benefit from it. Who will benefit from it? Mom, Papa. Eh? Papa, correct. You have a point there. Eh? You know she's my only sister. By the time he settles her, I will take over the business from her. You are mad. Hmm? Is she had a game, ma? Look at you. You stole my money and wasted it on those small, small girls you hang out with. Look at your life. Have you seen your life? Okay. Any little money that enters your hand, you will not allow it to enter your pocket. You will waste it on drinks, women, and cigar. Handing over a business to you is a total waste of effort. Huh? Yes. <clears throat> My daughter will hand her business over to me if she wants to get married. Mama, see, I know sister came the lame. She's my only sister. I know she will not condemn me like the way you're doing. You will hand over the business to I'm me. I'm not condemning you. You are condemning yourself. Nkem the lame will not hand over her business to you. She will hand it over to me if she wants to get married. Enough. I've said it. And I will continue to say it. What do you mean by enough? You push you wait for her to settle before you start arguing over who takes over her business. Uh, uh, uh. Mama, see, let me ask you, Mama. If I do not take over the business, what ex do you expect from me to do in this life? Eh? Can you just come Can you not see? Listen, let me tell you. If you're tying your future to that business, eh? Get ready for a very big disappointment of your life because I will not let you go close to it. I will never let you go close. See, Mama, I am your only son, and that is my right because Kem Delim is my only sister. By the time Kem Delim gets married, the business automatically becomes my own. I cannot be here. You are a madman. Mama, my sister. Have you listened to your son? Are you are you hearing your son? Is he not your son? Can't you stop? Can't you say something as what a do you man? Want me to say? Is he not your son? Are you a man at all? Let me even ask you. Leave me here. Me daddy, who can walk here? Come on, man. Kem delima, kem delim. She no get wala. Welcome. How are you? Fine, thank you. You don't go to school. Why are you playing there? They said I should go back home until I pay my school fees. Have you told mommy and dad about this? 
Yes, the time that mommy made with my teacher has passed. Lucky! I've been looking for you. Good day, ma. Okay, how are you? I'm fine, thank you, ma. Is it, is it true that Lucky has not been going to school? Yes. Things are getting bad by the day in Kim. Okay, uh, uh, Ma, please, can I get your account number so that I will send you money once I get to the market? Account number. Yes. Okay, where will you get the money from? Huh? Ma, I really want Lucky to go back to school. I'll find a way, don't worry. Okay. Yes. God will bless you. God bless you. Auntie Kendali, thank you. Hey, say it very well. Auntie Kendali, thank you. Yeah, I'm trying to be. Hey, you go back to school, okay? It's what, okay. What would you have done without you in this house? It's hey. okay. Man. Hey. Okay. I can't do. Do. Hey. Hello? Oga? Oga, please, do not come to the shop today. Don't come close to the shop at all. All the people you are owing, they are around the shop. Everyone! Even Ogemeka, Ogemeka is so furious. He has been saying a lot of things that he will do to you if he sees you with his two eyes. Yes, please, just, just stay away. I will handle everything. Yes, I will, I will. I just came out to call you. I'm not even at the shop. I think it's high time you left there already. You can't serve this man forever. Abuchi, I don't know how to leave them at this point. You have your own life to live. Don't waste it trying to please someone else. What do you want me to do? You have your own family to build. You need to get married. You need to have children. You need to work hard now that you still you want to, you know, gather for your kids. You, you don't waste it by being there. Hey, because don't make me feel like I'm making a mistake. Please. Okay. We are not making any mistake. You know, I love you so much. I am done serving. I was so excited when I heard that you are here to be married. We can build together. Please leave those people. Let's get married already. How long am I going to wait? Is this, is this about you? Is it? Is it just about you, Abuchi? No. Kim, it's not about me. It's about you. It's about us. It's about our future. Please. Sir. I think I have a plan. Which is? And we cannot sit here and do nothing. It won't help us. We need to start up something, no matter how little it is. Something like what? This is my plan. I, I think we need a loan. A loan? Yes. In as much as this looks good, but you can't be talking of loan. Have you forgotten we are still in debt because of all the loans we collected? I know, sir, but that's the only option. That's the only way to start up again. We can't sit back here and lick our wounds. It will do us no good. Rather, things will get worse. In as much as this looks good, I'm afraid. I don't want to run into more debts. Sir, please, you have to trust me. Let's try this one last time again. We can survive it. 
Please. All right. I will think about it. Okay, sir. Thank you so much. Thank you. Baby, I didn't hear the sound of your car. I've sold my car. What? Yes. And you didn't tell me? I know you won't let me if I had told you. Hey. Listen, my love, I can't even maintain that car anymore. Hey. So the best bet was to sell it and see if I could use the money to salvage our situation. Hey, has it got into that? Hey. Is there any food at home? I think it's time for me to leave this house. Now I understand why my father will always say the world is a harsh place. No room for the weak ones. The world is not a harsh place as we think. Only that the bad people will always make it look difficult than it should be. Uncertainty is inherent in life. No one sees a beat and fall into it. Our master did not see this coming. He didn't. That is not my business. See this time around, he must pay me. He must. If it will take him go rich in order to get money to settle me, he better do. Timothy. Yes. Do you want to add to his problems? Is that what you're trying to do? Listen, I've served this man for so many years. And if he doesn't want to settle me, even you'll be surprised at my action in this house. What? Yes. Tom Dillon. Sir. I sold my car. I want you to use the money and process the business idea you wrote down. I will transfer the money to you. Okay, sir. Trust me. I won't let you down. You've given me enough reason to trust you. Maybe this will be my last wish here. I pray you get back to your feet. Amen. If they release my goods, I will be rich again. I pray God touches their hearts. He will. He will do it for you. I believe. Amen. Okay, sir. I have a list for you. 
Okay, sir. I want you to get me the goods as soon as possible. Can you do that? Ah! Oga! Oh yeah. This is too much, oh. Hey! That's what you wanted. <laughs> Oga, okay, okay, please. Okay. I'll be needing some money to supply the goods. Oh, that's not a problem. Really? Just send me your account number. Let me call it, sir. Okay. Zero, zero. Four, four. Oh. Okay. <laughs> sorry, sir. Sorry, sir. Okay, no problem, no problem. Sorry, sir. Zero one. All right. Four zero. Okay. How long do you expect me to wait for you? Do you expect me to move on with my life without you? Oh, but why would you ask me such a question? What do you want me to tell you? What? I want to settle down. I want to start building my own home. I am the only son of my father, and you know that. Abuchi, you know that I left my home. I accepted to come here and work for this man just because of you. I and mean, when you left for service, I knew that my parents wouldn't let me wait for you. And now you want to move on without me? I don't want to move on without you. I want you in my life forever. But it's taking so much time. I would you understand what you're saying. But please, I beg you, give me a little more time. Please. I think I have an idea. But I'm not sure you will like it. But trust me, it's a good one. Oh. Yes. Okay. Share it with me. Okay. And um, what if we run away with the money on our disposal? Because since she has refused to say to us, let's say to ourselves. Timothy, why is your mind so dirty? Huh? Why? Why can't positive thoughts come out from this <gasps> stupid mind? Why are you shouting? Why? Listen, I know you don't like it, but trust me, this is the best idea. Let's say to ourselves, because this man is not ready to say to us at any time soon. Timothy, I do not have the same vision with you. Oh. Yes, so do not hear any stupid idea with me. If you want to do anything, do it on your own. Don't get me involved. Biko! Listen, with this mindset of yours, you will stay here for a long time. Really? Yes. At least I will live here with my head high. Mm. I will have my dignity and pride. Yes. Let me tell you, pride goes before you fall. Don't let pride to destroy your life. Let's take this money and face our life. Stop saying we. I don't have the same destiny with you, Timothy. Mm. Maybe you should do I like thieves. You go make them. Of course. Timothy, you go, even if you carry this money now, run. Will you still make it? I will make it. Will you make it? My name is Timothy, I will Shut make up. it. Shut up, you will not make anything. Get out. I should get out. Get I should get out. Your spirit right, I, I, I is surprising. You were high star girl. Straight to business. How much is there? 100,000. Interest. Total, how much now? 104,000. We know they owe your guy again now. We know they owe us. We know they owe you again now. We know they owe us. We know they don't come up for debit list. Nice one. It's too much. Oh. Thank God. Ahem. Yeah. Make I still tell you. My uncle say make I tell you. As you don't pay this money. You dey free to come for leg goose now. As long as say you go pay money on time. You go give on a goose on credit. You be very foolish. You are very, very foolish. You go make them? I go make them. Will you make it? I will make it. If I see you close to my gas shop again, eh? You will never make it in this life. I go make them. Not be my fault. Oh. Not be me, they all. Not be me, they all. Not be me, they all. You better call your gun. You know, pay debt to a whole suit. You call my hair for my gas shop. You know how much I take to make this hair? She can do anything. Can it. What a man can do, she can do it. People will get icy. See, I'm She's a hustle like a man.
You mean you cleared all these debts? Yes, sir. You can start coming out now. Are you serious? Yes, sir. Baby. Hey. Kim. Thank you. You're welcome, man. God bless you. Bless you too. You're, you're such a hustler. <laughs> so you can start coming out now. <laughs> Hey. <laughs> Did you do this, huh? <laughs> it's good, sir. Thank you very much. Hey. It's okay, sir. Thank you very much. You're welcome, sir. This girl is awesome. So She's a hustler. Papa! Papa, good evening, sir. Good evening, sir. Good evening, sir. Papa, good evening. You didn't tell me you were coming. Not even a phone call. You better behave yourself. I have allowed you to act wisely. But instead, you've decided to keep me in the dark. What is going on? Che, <clears throat> don't be angry. I'm trying my best. I want to, let's say, by December. Stop telling me you are trying. Stop trying. Release my daughter. I'm tired of you trying. Release my daughter. Even if you don't want to settle her right now, just let her go. Please, it hasn't gotten to that. It has gone beyond that. It has. How many years do you want a woman to serve you before you let her go? When you came to me, remember, you told me the apprenticeship was going to be for five years. Now it's gone beyond five. As a matter of fact, it is six to be precise. Are you people this wicked? Papa, Papa, please. You have to calm down. Eh? Let's sit down and talk about this. Biko, oh. Ichi, I know she's your daughter. Nobody is disputing that fact. But at least sit down. Let's talk this out amicably. We are not fighting. You, if only you know how I have been blamed for allowing you to come here. You will not think twice. You will not hesitate. You will just go into this house, pack your things, and follow me back to the village right now. But you, Christian, don't sound like that. Itchy. Itchy. People, we'll talk about it. This is your daughter. No one is disputing that fact. But at least, let's sit down and talk this out man to man. Amicably, we're not fighting. Please, Jay. I'm going through a lot this period. Please. You can talk things out. Oh? Because you're Nino. Biko, Uto. Uto, calm down. You know? Please. Where is my daughter? Eh? You have at least welcomed me first and offered me water to drink now. I will only welcome you if I see my daughter. If Nkem Delim is not with you, hey, that means I will go there. Yes! I will go there. Well, he begged me to give him till the end of this year. And you accepted? He begged you and you agreed to his nonsense? Uh, you people are taking my patience for granted. Look at you. You accepted it. Eh? Are you not ashamed? Eh? Are you not ashamed of yourself that you accepted what? Look at you. Are you sure you are man enough? Eh? You people are taking my patience for granted. In fact, I will locate their house. And when I get there, the whole street will know that I came. In fact, the entire state will witness what I will do to him. Can you imagine? And you're coming back like this. Look at you. I told you I cannot go there and fight them. You cannot go there and fight them? All we did was discuss and reach a certain agreement. Hey! And I came back. I just pray he keeps to his own part of agreement. Hey! I 
I'm ashamed of you. Yes. This is not the first time we had an agreement with Boniface. And he failed. You see, one day and had another agreement with him. Are you not ashamed? Are you not ashamed of yourself? Eh? Look at you. You are a foolish man. In fact, it's time for me to divorce you. Because you're not making sense to me. You're not man enough. Eh? Look at how he is, Seth. You, you, you left my daughter and came back here empty-handed. And you're calling yourself a man. Are you a man? Look, look at. Hey! I'm, I'm even ashamed of myself marrying you. Nekushi, kushi, nekushi, kushi. If you're not making a ganozo, I know here. Don't worry. I will visit him. And when I get there, <laughs> he will know that I came. He will not like what I will do to him. And you will hear the story. Yes, you will hear the story. And you will not like it. I think it's time for me to divorce you. Because you are not a man. You are not a man. Look at you. You are coming back. Look at how, how, you, how you are coming. Are, are, you, are, you, are, you, are, you, are you sure you are a man? Eh? Don't worry. I will visit him. And when I get there, <laughs> he will know that I came. He will not like what I will do to him. And you will hear the story. Yes, you will hear the story. And you will not like it. Hey! Oh! Oh, my God. A man will make money for two hours. Then have a problem with woman for 24 hours. <laughs> fear will not fear woman, no. You know, this is my mother. When you face man, I'm fine. Um, I'm sure you know. Everyone here. Of course. This is DK now. DK. This is Anima. That's Tony Afon. All of us did the same market now. Your own now. You are no pass for here. Last week, Nami and you did. So basically, I know them. I know you more. Okay. Um but we are not doing the same thing. Yeah. All right. All right. Look, this is the reason why we will never have this kind of problem you are facing right now. We gather together as friends, help one another, do things together. Or of course, you know, all of us will not have problem at the same time. So, any one of us who is going through a hard time or facing any form of challenges in business or whatever, we rally around that individual and make sure that that problem is solved. Right. That is the essence of our friendship. Is this a secret code? Come on, man. Come on. Oh. A secret code? No. That is nothing like that. As you can see, this is a hotel, a bar, a public bar. How secret does such a place appear to you? Okay. As no you are doing fuzo. Having said that, I'm happy to be here. You're welcome. Meanwhile, um, concerning what you told me. By tomorrow morning, or let us know, you have your goose out. Excuse me. Yes. Just like that. Yes. Just like that. Philosophy. Are you sure about what you just said? <laughs> I know you won't believe me. 
But soon, you will. That my goods will be released tomorrow. Guaranteed. Lucy, if it happens, I will worship you. <laughs> Come on, beat man. <laughs> if they release my goods, guy, I'm gonna say you get power. Just be loyal to this friendship. Deeper than brotherhood. 100%. Just be loyal. We have a greeting code. More like a. Very simple. Nothing to worry about. You know. Like uh, a swag. You know. Greeting. Swag. So all we just do, we just put our hands together. Don't be long Run away from me. Run away from me. Oh, give me. No. Left hand. Okay. Well, I love you. This one is okay. Run away from me. Well, I love you. Baby, guess what? Baby, baby, baby. Baby, guess what? Baby, guess what? what? Just guess. What? They have released my goods. Hey! Oh my God! They have released my goods. I'm so happy. God has finally Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, God is real. God is real. Thank you, Jesus. They have released my goods. Thank you, Jesus. We are rich again. I'm back on my feet. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Hey! Jesus, Thank you. This God What do you want? Anything. Don't accept it. Run away from me. I want to personally thank both of you for standing by my side all through my downtime. Thank you very much. You people put in a lot of effort in marketing our goods and today we are back on our feet. So thank you very much. I appreciate your effort and trust me, I will surprise both of you. You're welcome, sir. welcome, sir. We'll keep doing our best. Mm -hmm. And I'm happy to share this moment with everyone. Yes. You're um, welcome, sir. Before now, we've been doing well. Even when we don't have enough goods or money to buy and supply. But this time around, I promise to hit the market like never before. Nice. Once again, thanks for your cooperation, thanks for your commitment, and thanks for your loyalty. You're welcome, sir. You're welcome, sir. Sir? Go and uh, make marketing, right? Place advert. Okay. We're supplying sir. from Monday. Alright, sir. You, count that 7x4 and tell me how many cutters we have left. Alright, sir. Alright, sir. Thank you, sir. I'm so excited that we have finally bounced back on our feet. Yes, baby. It feels good to bounce back. Yes, baby. Oh. Let's toast to our new car mm -hmm. and more blessings to come. Mm, amen. <laughs> Cheers. Cheers. Mm -hmm. oh. Nice one. You like it? I love it. <laughs> That's such a beautiful soul. Thank you, darling. So, baby, mm -hmm. I thank God things are finally turned around for us. Yeah. So, I think it's time for us to settle our servants. Mm -hmm. Especially in Kem Dilim. Yes. Until it's really heaven sent to this family. You're right, baby. Mm -hmm. It's time to settle in Kem Dilim. You see, in Kem Dilim, mm -hmm. her settlement will be talk of town. Mm -hmm. I will settle her like a queen. Oh, she deserves it. Daddy, can yeah. you take us to the amusement park? Amusement park? Mm. Tomorrow or today? Tomorrow. Tomorrow. Consider it down. Mm. <laughs> um. Wait, are they gone? Make a hope wait. Hey! 
Nkem! Nkem! Nkem, what are you still doing here? Okay. Where are you taking me to? Hey. Okay, listen to this. I'm mm. amusement park. Mm -hmm. mm. Go shopping. Oh, thank you, baby. Hey, baby. Oh. Bye bye. Bye bye. Ah. Can you drive? Bye bye. Oh, then. Okay, I'll get you. <laughs> That's nice. Cheers to your power bike. Oh, <laughs> oh baby. Oh. Why are you looking so furious? Like, what are you doing here? Mm. Oh, thank God you noticed that I'm ready to fight. Uh. You can't tell him. Go in there, pack your things, and come, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let us go home. I'm not going anywhere. I'm not going anywhere. You can't dream. I will slap this your stupid mouth and turn it at the back of your head. Go in there, bring your things, let's go home. Mama, I won't go anywhere. Go home, I'll come and meet you. Did that What's this? Get in there. Go and bring your things, let us go. Are you foolish? Oh, you are asking me why am I shouting? I will shout and make the entire street notice that like uh, enough water. Go on there and bring your things, let us go. I'm walking in water, what is this? I said go there and bring your things, let's go. You're, you're, you're telling me you're not going. What do you mean by that? You're, who is your guy? Mama, Who is your uh -huh. Boniface or whatever they call your name? Do not tell me to calm down. Even if my late father's ghost appears here right now, nothing will stop me from taking my daughter out of this house. Please, let us go. Mama, okay, okay, mama. Go, go, go. Mama, okay, mama. Calm down. At least come inside. Let's offer you something. You are a very stupid woman. Shut up your mouth. Mama, Look at you. Hey, Michonu. Michonu, mm. let me say something. Let me talk to you. In Apuara. Eh? A woman like you is in your house. Wasting away in the name of apprenticeship. And you still do not have any good reason to send her home. You allow her in your house wasting. Eh? Mama. Don't let me say a bad word to you. Look at you at your age, you have a grown up child. You still allow another woman's child in your house. Hey! Mama. Mabugo. Mama. Mabugo. Mama. You please. can't tell him. If you know what is good for you, go in there and bring your things. Let us go. Mama, please go. I'm giving you two options. Mama, go home. I'll come and meet you. Now. Game the lemon. Go home. What's this? You can't tell him. You can't tell him. Mama, mama, mama. You not allow me create crazy things here. I'm giving you two options in Kemdelem. It's either you kill me here right now or you follow me home. But nothing will make me allow you stay one more night in this house. Go and bring Mama, this. give me a Go and bring your things. Mama, 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 Mama. Why let me Has it got into this? Yes, it has gotten to this. No problem. Kemdelem, follow her. Yes! Kemdelem, follow me. Go and bring your things. Mama, you are, this is not fair. What, what, what is not What you're doing now is not fair. Mama, Mama, just, just, hey, shut up! Shut up your mouth, Amoja. Mama, please talk to my wife with some respect. Hey, shut up your mouth! Go in there, whatever they call you, Bonifaz or whoever you are. I don't care to know now. You can't deliver. Go there and bring your things. Mama, Mama I don't like this. You're doing now. I don't like it. Yes, you will not like it. I don't even expect you to like it. Look at you. You did the apprenticeship. Bonifaz said to my daughter, no. Allow my daughter to go now in Abudiara. If you know what I suffer to give birth to you, you will have everything to whatever rubbish you are doing. Mama, you came here to embarrass me. Allow me to make it now. Eh? Let me make my make up. If I don't make it now, my face I'm make up. Yes, you will make it. You will make it in the village. Mama, please, you what? give me this. this, 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 this. I will not let you waste away. Give me the name. Go and bring your things. Let's go. You don't have water. Oh, don't mama me. Who are you? You put on it. Eh, Timothy. Don't talk to me! Shut up! Shut up! Get out of my face! I'm going. Hey, go! Okay, Chigi! You can't tell him! I heard you have boys that are sapping under you. Yes, sir. Including a girl. But I want to settle them next week. That will be the biggest mistake. Why? It is against our rule. What rule are you talking about? The rule of Covenant Friends. Covenant Friends? What rule in life will stop a human being from settling someone that served him without any problem? We agreed that you will serve me for this number of years. They came, they served, they even added Jara. So why don't I settle them? 
Well, that's not it for all this now. You're already in. Face the reality, man. Yeah? Lucy. Did you put me in a secret court without my consent? Life itself is a secret. Deal with it that way. That's how the world is made. I think what you should be focusing your mind on now is going to your village to take a cheap day tonight. So that we will stop into your village and make that ceremony cut off. That's what the brotherhood will let me achieve. Focus on that, not all this you are talking about. Thank you so much, sir. No problem, sir. I'll be waiting. God bless you, sir. All right, sir. Bye, sir. Thank you. Bye. Ah! Oh, my goodness. Hey, sister. Oh, my God! So, who was that on the phone? Hey, my boss. He said he's coming tomorrow to settle me. How can you get a good night? Yeah, yeah, yeah. What's up? What's up? What's up? I am not a big man. Hey! Settle you. Settle me! Yeah! Oh, man! You are my name, Mother Monica. You are my name, Mother Monica. You are my name, Mother Monica. You see? You see what I'm saying? Finally. I can't wait for him to come, eh? Because by the time he comes and says to you, I will take over your shop from you. Automatically, I become a big boy. Shut up, shut up. Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! I tell you, I tell you, I tell you, I tell you. It's not about taking over. You go make him. Hi, go go, sister. You know. Hey, Buka, will you make it? Mm, yes, I will make it. I know I will make it. Sister, you know I will make you it. Better stop this or dead dream. It will not come to pass. Uh, uh, but sister, I, I have agreed with Mama and Papa that by the time you get married, I will take over your son from you. The business become my own. Yes. You are such a big joke. Huh? Hey, Buka, you are a joker. Yes, that's what you are. You better wake up from this your dream now. You better wake up now. Because if you don't wake up now, you may have to wake after 40. And a food at 40 is a food forever. What you get? Then you will regret all of the time you wasted at home doing nothing. But sister, I'm the name I'm your only brother. Eh? Yes. Shut up. Before, before I give you my camera. Thank you, ma. Uh, uh, the truth is that the business is my business. Eh? By the time they say to you, in fact, suitors will start coming that day. As they are settling you, they will marry you. If I will even add up the bride price money. Inside the business, oh boom, what? What can we do here? Can I come with you? If I'm not a very good candidate, I'm not going to be a very good candidate. Meet him, meet him. When no one's even there, I'm not going there. Sister, our settlement is around the corner. Hmm. 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 Dickie, what are you doing here? You are someone in the upper chamber. I am not interested in your evil gathering. Leave my shop. The earlier you realize it, the better for you. I said I am not interested. You are joking. Better face the reality and leave. Dickie, so you belong to a secret court. You even disappear and appear. This is unbelievable. As a member of the Covenant Brothers, you are about to do much more. Go and tell them that I said I am not interested in their evil gathering. Don't place your neck on the edge of a sharp sword. If you do, don't blame anyone when you see your head rolling on the floor. It is your own head that will roll, decay. This is your own head that will rule, not mine. I am not interested in your covenant brothers or whatever you call it, and that's some period. Onye wole go anaba cult. Onye wole go anaba cult. Oje magene, leave my office at once. Before I leave, let me remind you once more: you are needed at the upper chamber tonight. Leave at once. You are financially okay. God has blessed you enough. 
All you need just now is to be prayerful. Don't be longer. Run away from me. Run away from me. You Don't accept me. Run away from me. Timothy. Sir. I hope you can drive. Perfectly, sir. Good. Take this car. Okay, sir. Drive right behind me. Alright, sir. Look at what I brought upon myself. Jimo, Maranamo, I have put my hands trying to warm my fingers. Oh, I will Jimo. What is it? So I don't know. The car refused to start. What do you mean by you don't know? Just like that. Yes, sir. Let me have the keys. Before we left. not to settle your servant. Boniface, you are mandated not to settle your servant. You are mandated not to settle your servant. What am I doing here? I told you, I don't want to be part of any secret cult. I don't need it. I'm already successful before I met you guys. What's the need? On my own, money day, Roget is a choke. So I don't need any cult. What am I doing here? You're already in. No going back. What do you mean by you're in already? There's no going back. You want to initiate me into a court without my consent? Even if I'm in, why would you be telling me not to settle people that serve me wholeheartedly for years? Why? What would I tell their people? That is wickedness. Why wouldn't I settle my boys and girls? The Most High Lord of Covenant Brothers does not kill his own who are obedient. And being obedient means you must attend our meetings and also you must get servants that will serve you at least once in two years. Don't dare settle them. So what becomes of them when I don't settle them? What will I tell their people? What will people think of me? With the power that you possess, no man will ever think any evil of you. 
no matter how bad you are. So what becomes of them? The Most High will inflict them with a dangerous disease, frustration, then death, mysterious death. You know, see, you lie. I can never be part of another man's downfall. I am a wealthy young man before I met you all. I don't need to belong to any secret cult to be successful. We all must not belong to any secret cult. Yes. Boniface, you must not allow any of your servants to start business with your money. Yes, there will be consequence. You will die. You don't see. I will not die. I will not die. Alone, she read my lips. I will not die. I repeat, I am a wealthy young man. Physically, there is cash. Spiritually, I day. Rugged choke. For that reason, I do not need to belong to this secret cult. I am not interested in your covenant brothers or whatever you call it. Only will lay that have a cult. Only Jago and have a cult. I do not need you people to be successful or whatever you call it. And that's some period. Covenant brothers! Together, together we stand, stand for each other. Covenant brothers! Together, together we stand for each other. Covenant brothers! Together we stand for each other. His phone is ringing, but he's not picking up. I told you. I told you that Boniface is a chameleon. He will never do anything right. I told you. Mama, he is not like that. I believe something is stopping him on the way. He, he, he's not that kind of person. He's all right. But whether he settles you or not, my joy now is that you are out of there so that you can focus on your life. My daughter, don't worry. He must say to you, if he refuses, I will report him to the king. Trust me, he cannot go away with your sweat. Mm. Huh? <laughs> face. I know what he can do. I know he will support me. Madam! 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 Madam, please what come. Is it? Madam, what, what, has is it? What, what has happened? What has happened? They said Oga had an accident. What? Madam, please come. Madam, Madam, please come. <laughs> Madam, please come. Madam, please come. Madam, please come. Madam, please come. Boniface, you shall live long. Accident is not your portion. Untimely death is not your portion. Hey, Father, anyway, anyway, they are planning accidents. I come against it in Jesus' name. I come against it in Jesus' name. Oh, okay. I'm sorry, I won't start with greetings. This is the fifth week. This is the fifth week since you and your husband promised to come and say to me. Is this how you want to pay me for everything I've done for you? Is it? Okay. This was what we just discussed now before he left. Okay. We love you and you know. You love me. And I have to beg you to say to me. It will not cost him an arm to say to me. I don't even need to beg him to settle me. Because 
I already know that my destiny does not lie in the hands of any man. Yes. Madam, your husband has been playing me like what? He has been playing me like what? And this is last card. Tell him I said this is the last card. And his remaining checkup. I left my home and I came to this place to make it. I leave village and I come city, come make him. But you and your husband say I no go make him. You people said I will not make it. No problem. I only came here to see how you people are faring. And I can see you are doing very great. You are doing good. God bless you. Thank you. Okay. Okay. Boniface. Boniface. Is that to this girl? No. Is that to this girl? What's, what's going on? Boniface, I don't understand you. I don't understand you. Huh? This is so bad. Very bad. So after everything came did for these people, they did not settle her. Huh? I've always known this man to be a wicked man. An evil man. This is bad. Well, I will not be as naive as you came. Never. I will not be that stupid. I will open my eyes. Yes. But if somehow, if somehow. Why? Abuchi. Yeah. The truth is, I have a lot of people that want to do business with me. So I want to use this opportunity and start up my own business. What do you think? Well, that's a good idea. But I don't know why you both don't want to settle you. After all you've suffered in that house. Are you sure he's going to allow you to, to open your own shop in this town? Why won't he? If he tries to stop me, eh? I will know he's looking for my trouble. <laughs> he won't even take. The reason I'm saying this is because most masters, they don't allow their servants to open, the same, um, to open a shop in the same plaza or the same place with them. Because they feel the servants are going to be the major competitor that they have. My God. If he tries it with me, my God will fight for me. He won't even try it. He won't. <laughs> it's okay. Uh, well, I won't tell you to reject this mouth watering offer you're getting right now. But the only thing I want to tell you is that you need to be very, very careful. You get me? Okay? Sure. Businesswoman. <laughs> you always call me that. Bonnie first. You are breaking the law. How many times have I warned you to stop coming here to bother my life? Boniface, the stubborn fly follows the curve to the grave. You have no option than to obey the law of the Covenant Brothers. If you keep ignoring the law, you are setting yourself up for a rope. You are talking nonsense. In case you've forgotten, before I met you people, I was rich. That you rendered a little help doesn't mean you should take my life. Tell if you don't see that I am not interested. I can never be part of that Covenant Brothers. <laughs> Boniface, the Kendalim has succeeded in starting up her own business. If you don't stop her, you will die. If you destroy your servant, your spirit will serve you forever. God will not allow you to take my life. Yes, I will not die and I will not destroy any of my servants. Tell Ilonsi that I will never be part of you people's cult. Simple. Onye Wolego, Adaba cult. Onye Jego, Adaba cult. Nonsense. I overheard you talking to somebody. What? I can't see anybody here. I hope all this was. Sir. 
So how is business going? I thank God. <laughs> I can <laughs> see. You've restocked already. Of course. <laughs> it's booming. Yeah, I'm the limb. Who gave you the permission to open business in this market without my consent? Are you seriously saying I shouldn't have opened my own business? Do you want me to serve it forever? It is illegal to open your own shop when you are not yet settled. Settled? Hmm? You have refused to settle me and you don't want me to open my own shop. What do you want? Do you want me to jump into the river? Listen, you must close this business at once. That's a lie. You will not establish anything until I settle you. That's a very big lie. You lie. See, if you come from a girl like that, you have me to deal with. You should be ashamed of yourself, man. This girl has served you for so many years and you've refused to settle her. Huh? Lover boy, be careful the river you jump into. Else you will drown. Now you're threatening me because I'm explaining to you to settle my girl. Is that it? Shut down this business for your own good. That's a lie. Shabi, you don't make up now. Just say you don't make up now. That's a lie. You don't the fuck off now now. They go. Just say you don't blow now. Not where they enter you again now. You don't make up now. You don't arrive. This, is what I'm telling this you. one is a very wicked person. That's what I'm telling you. That this one is evil. I told you. Just imagine. I told you. Once they see that you are the best in whatever you do, they won't want to settle you. Like so that they will keep ripping from you. I told you. And you're telling me that, yeah, he's going through some things, this, that, that. That's, this is their pattern. They do this all the time. Yeah, the girls who come to my shop and ask me to close it. He can't do it. He just wants to play. Okay? Just relax. <laughs> he must be joking. Dear customer, <sighs> the MTN number you have dialed is not reachable at the hey. moment. Please. Hey. Hey. Hey, where is he? Yeah? Hey! Hey! Honey, honey, the worst has happened. Honey, the worst has happened. Oh. What happened? Are you okay? I'm not okay. What How happened? can I be okay? What happened? Timothy ran away with the 5 million naira I gave him to deposit in our business account. Till now, he's nowhere to be found. He's not by, he's not even going again. It's unavailable. Timothy, <laughs> run away with my five million naira. Yes. How could he? You see what I've been telling you to settle this guy? You see what I've been telling you to settle Timothy? He can't be seeing lots of money with you, and you'll be telling him stories about settlements. Now, see. Baby, don't worry, I will trust him. Don't worry, I will trust him. Have you tried this number? It's not good. It's not available. I've been trying it since. Wait. Are you are you blaming me? I'm telling you the truth. Someone needs to tell you the truth. You see, babe, all these things that are happening to us. Are avoidable. If you had settled him, we won't be doing, we won't be looking for him. All these things will not be happening. Really, you are going back. Let me five million. <coughs> Timothy, run away with my five million now. <laughs> hey. I heard you saying that you saved your boss and he refused to settle you. 
I also serve the boss and refuse to settle me. That's why I'm doing this job. He's your boss. They sent her to come and kill your fiance and bring your life to the coven. It would be very bad of me if I should lay a hand on you. As for your fiance, he's dead and already disposed. You have to get that from here. And now. Papa, mama. Hey, the worst has happened. What happened? The worst has happened. Here, yeah. someone just told me that in Kemdele, my only sister has been kidnapped by unknown men. No, Jiji, Banamro. God forbid. It's you that they kidnapped. Why would you joke with a thing like that? Can you imagine? I'm not joking. I can't be joking. I just told you that someone told me that in Kemdele was kidnapped. I've been calling her line and she's not picking her phone. If you doubt me, try it. You will see. You see? I've told you several times to stop smoking and you refuse. If this is one of your jokes, you better stop it too. Because you will not like what I will do to you. In fact, Mama, look at my eye. Let me get hey, my, 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 my eye. Let me my eye. You see? Papa? This is not joke. I need to hear Hey! They just kidnapped her. Uh -huh, Papa? You see what I'm saying? Hmm? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Let this be a joke. Let this be a joke. Uh, Papa? Let me tell you. This is not a joke. Have you ever heard that uh, a non government kidnapped somebody and it's a joke? How can I be joking that they kidnapped my only sister? Came to them. Have you forgotten that she's my investment? I can't joke with something like this. Uh, Mama, start calling her. Try it, you see it. Papa, what you'll be saying is how. But let's start going, Papa. Let's go and know what we'll do. Covenant brothers, together we stand for one another. Covenant brothers, together we stand for one another. Covenant brothers, together we stand for one another. Hironsi, where is Boniface? His sacrifice is supposed to be on this altar today. He failed. There is no room for pardon this time. He will pay the ultimate price for failing the rules of Covenant brothers. But I helped him plan the kidnapping. I know it was a success. They're supposed to bring the girl here today. I don't know what happened. Even Boniface. I don't know why he's not here. The boys failed. And their failure means his death. He handed his life to the Covenant Brothers the day he partook on the Covenant Brothers' greeting. And he has no right for his life anymore. The one who has the right to his life has decided to take it today and he has nothing to do about it. Covenant brothers, together we stand for one another. Covenant brothers, together we stand for one another. Covenant brothers, together we stand for one another. I was... 
I was initiated into a secret court <coughs> without my consent. <coughs> Covenant brothers, they, they deceived me. I never knew it was a court. I only went to to Vilosi to ask for help. He rendered a helping hand, but I never knew he was leading me to my death. Why did you send people to kill an innocent girl that single-handedly helped us throughout the happens? Eh? Why did you do it? They, they gave me condition. <laughs> that I will never settle any of my apprentices. <laughs> and if any of them opens any business without my consent, the person will be sacrificed at the altar of covenant friends. Did you hear that? If not God has saved me, I would have been a dead person by now. How mean! <laughs> you sent your assassins to kill my fiancé. They killed him. He did nothing to you. You even asked them to kill me after everything I did for you. Even in your death, you will know no peace. <laughs> Okay, baby, bunny face. Bunny face. Baby. Bunny face. Enough. All you need just now is 